Some people don't know the meaning of MMIW, and that's Missing Murdered Indigenous Woman. MMIP is Missing Murdered Indigenous People. MMIR, Missing Murdered Indigenous Relatives. My name is Martina Maryboy. My clan is Kithachitni, Twitchitni, Bashishchin, Batahti, Dashache, Toshche, Dashanella. This is how I carry myself. A prayer run is where we put our foot down for prayers. Every mile, every quarter mile, it all has to be covered by a runner or a walker. And at that time, you know, people are, the one or runner or walker is got prayers going for the MMIW, for their safe return, hopefully reunite with their family, and also a prayer for the family as well. And we rarely have any awareness out in this area. I've never seen it done in the Four Corners. I've done several prayer runs out in California, and I just wanted to come back and help my family, help my community, help my relatives, and just to bring this awareness. So a few of my brothers and I, we've talked about it, and we started one back in August, and it's been pretty good. Um, just trying to bring the awareness in Utah, Colorado, New Mexico, and Arizona. My name is uh, Michael Vernon Shorty, and I am here to help my uh, Diné sister out with this uh, Four Corners prayer run. When we all come together, it's, it's a really strong feeling. You know, you have that spirit there, and then you have the prayers, and then, you know, you just, it's just, just that love. And it's it's a real powerful feeling. It's it's one of the you know it's real it's a special feeling. And for a lot of people who see us and that join us, you know, a lot of non-natives they really feel it too. And then when people want to join, be more involved, so it builds and builds connections and connections. And it's like saying, wow, you know, I I never knew that there was so many people that cared. I really can't say I'm going to achieve something but I am achieving by bringing the awareness out. We don't get enough media attention. We don't get a lot of uh, law enforcement involvement um, down to search and rescue. Don't have the technology, you know, um, drones, airplanes. All we could do is keep this awareness going, hoping that one of, this, one of these days it'll just end. You know, I've been doing this for a while. <clears throat> Travel, traveling across the country, going to a lot more um, other reservations, helping, supporting, giving. Um, I guess when one of your family members go missing, a really close family member of mine goes missing, and this happened like uh, a couple weeks ago. Uh, by clan, he's like my brother, but he's like my uncle through a distant family. And that, that's, I guess it made it more personal. I want to be the voice for my missing sister, our missing relatives, and it's, uh, personally, that's how I feel. You know, I want to be the voice for them, and I want to be the one to put their foot down for prayers. Hopefully, I, I really do make a difference. I'm getting more people involved, more voices. I mean, we are the voices for those that are missing, our missing relatives, our missing sisters, our missing brothers, our missing kids, our missing grandmas, our missing grandfathers. We are the voice, and hopefully one of these days it all comes to an end. That's, that's what I'm after.